Carnell Alexander is being ordered to pay back child support for a child that is not his. The Detroit man says it's a matter he has tried to fix for years, but again and again he's found himself confused by the legal process. Now, after we told you about his story, an attorney stepped in to help out, but is it too late? 7 Action News reporter Kim Russell joins us now on a story that has a judge ruling in this case. It's a story that inspired outrage. Carnell Alexander says he got a shock during a traffic stop in Detroit in the early 90s. The officer told him he's a deadbeat dad, he's under arrest. The problem? Carnell didn't have any kids. He'd been made a dad by default after an ex listed him as father when applying for welfare benefits. The notice of hearing went to a house, not prison, where he was incarcerated. Today, he went to court hoping a judge would fix it. Instead, his story inspired a different kind of outrage. I'm outraged that Mr. Alexander, for two and a half decades, failed to take this matter seriously. Judge Kathleen McCarthy ruled he waited too long to let the court know what happened. And I, I just feel like it's unfair. But Carnell says that's not exactly accurate, that he's gone to court many times and every time has told the judge that he's been in front of that he's not the father. That he shouldn't have to pay for that child. Every every court appearance that she say I made, I made it clear to them that I was not the father of the child, and I was trying to reach out to Miss Hood, who I could not reach. However, that doesn't stop the fact that he needed help. His attorney, Jerica Harris, says she took on this case after hearing about it on Seven Action News. As a result, she says she was shocked when the judge not only said a man will pay for a kid that's not his, but criticized 7 Action News for sharing the story. I'm outraged at the media for their willful misrepresentations of the facts of this case, casting this court in a negative light with little to no facts to support these claims. You were inspired by our story to step in and take on this case. Did you feel that you were misled at all? I don't feel I was misled because everything you reported seems to me to still be true. Attorney Harris says she will file more motions for Carnell. In Detroit, Kim Russell, 7 Action News.